We're working on an old spinet from uh, mid-century that used plastic that is very brittle. And this was pretty common for these, uh, these mid-century pianos to use this plastic that is just totally breakable. Now, from, from what I understand, the, the modern plastic isn't going gonna, isn't gonna to do that. Now, I mean, who knows what's going to happen 70 years from now. But, uh, but it's, from what I understand, it's just a totally different formulation, and it's much stronger. So this piano, uh, you can see several have, have been replaced already, and I think the people just got sick of having them break and having, someone, having to have someone come out again and again and again. To, uh, to just replace one, so they're just, they're just getting it all done, which is really the right choice. So this is kind of an assembly line type project. You can just go through and just break all of these off. Let's do three of them. So break all of those off. Break off the... Off all the old plastic, and I'm going to put this little end of the threads right here in the in the drill. And I'm going to go slowly till, and I'm, I'm going to go very slowly and watch watch it go to the end until it uh, bottoms out on the in the clear plastic at the end there. There it is. There's two. So you see it bottom out there. There's three. Then to get these off, I'm gonna use a smaller needle nose and I'm just gonna kind of crush the old plastic there and eventually I'll get down to there it is to the felt. So so if we uh, you know if we're we don't want to crush, you know, my finger being the pin. We don't want to. We don't want to like put too much pressure on the pin. We kind of want to crush it, crush it, crush it, until we're down to the felt, and then we can grab it, grab the felt, you know, that, that wraps around the pin, grab it just in front of it, and then just yank it off. And so there again, that's kind of an assembly line thing. So just kind of crush, crush, crush. There it is. If you do break these wood sides, they can be repaired. I've done it before. It's obviously want to avoid that if you can, but sometimes, sometimes it breaks. Okay, so there's almost three. And then this, it has a little opening there where the pin just snaps right in. You have to make sure that you feel a very positive snap. So the first, let's see, the first little feeling of getting it on the pin, it's not on yet. You have to feel a snap. I don't know if you can, can see that. So here again. One last time, it's on the pin slightly, right there, but then snap. Okay, now it's on there, on there good. So this, this whole project, and I will mention sometimes on some pianos you don't have this little, this little end that you can put the drill onto, which makes it a little bit trickier, but it can still be done. You, it just takes a lot of wrist power. Just lock it in the vice grips. And just do it that way. 
takes a little bit more time. And your wrist gets sore after probably, I don't know, a few of them. And there it is, bottomed out. And ready to go. So again, kind of assembly line work where you can do all of the, break them all off, then uh, take off any residual elbows. You can drill them all in, just, you know, and then just kind of go through the whole assembly line. The whole, the whole project shouldn't take more than a couple hours or so.